exhilarating. As we know, only 15 of our contestants will get through to the semi-final. And from those 15, our judges will choose the final six. And then, of course, our new Miss World 2005. So, let's find out who's taking the next two places in that semi-final lineup. Please welcome the Miss World contestants from the Americas. Colombia, Costa Rica, Guatemala, Guyana. Canada, United States, Ecuador, El Salvador, Mexico, Nicaragua. Uruguay, Venezuela, All amazing contestants, but only two can go forward. You voted. The decision has been yours. The next place in the semi-final goes to... Canada! With one more place for a contestant from the Americas, and that place goes to... Mexico! winning Miss World mean to you? Ni hao. Uh, and, well, I think uh, for me it's very special because in Mexico it's going to be the first one and I feel very proud to be here. Thank you very much. Now name one thing you'd like the world to know about your country. Well, in my country, um, it's a very multicultural country. I think it's one of the most multicultural countries in the world. And um, it's very inviting to foreigners. Um, you could come there and live your dream and reach heights. And also that um, <laughs> it's just a wonderful country. Thank you very much. I'm going to book a holiday now. Ladies and gentlemen, our semi-finalists from the Americas. So, just how did they persuade you to vote for them? Let's take a look right now. Hi, my name is Ramona Amiri and I'm 25 years old and representing Canada. As a proud Canadian, I'm happy to be living in a country where I can celebrate my Persian and Assyrian heritage. I've graduated with my Bachelor of Science degree in General Biology and hope to go to medical school in the near future. ¿Qué tal? I'm Daphne Molina, I'm 23 years old and I'm here to represent Mexico. In this moment I'm a model, but I would like to work in a, as an interior designer. My friends tell me that the, through my eyes they see pure heart. I believe that I am strong enough to conquer anything. I look forward to the future.